You guys, what's going on? I decided to open the second um, championship collection that I bought. I think this is from the same one or the same Walmart and the same time I bought both of them as the last one. So the last one was really, really nice. Got a lot of good autographs and I hit that um, one touch case. I guess the one that everybody is telling me is super rare to get. Um, like the rare dual promos. So I find it very hard that uh, it's going to have another one in here because when you buy these at Walmart, there's four in a, I guess, a crate, I guess you can call it maybe, or a box. Um, so this was, there was two left in the, because on the display, there, it could only fit four. So I believe this is either four or six, but this is the last two that were in that one. So... I mean, I'm not going to wish, oh, that's pretty sweet. That, I'm not going to wish that um, it's not as good, but um, I hope you guys can't see that. That's totally something different, but I don't, I don't want to kind of keep you guys waiting. And teasing. Actually, I should say I don't want to tease you guys by what the bonus stuff was. Uh, but it's actually it was pretty interesting. Uh, so, $20 Walmart. Um, all retail packs. And these are the regular four packs. And these are the three fat packs. Now, this is a little bit better. Not that I'm complaining. But um, these are actually fatter than the other ones, even though I think I did hit an autograph or I hit it in, in hoops, I think. Um, and that's cool because they give you like one f thicker pack too, just in case if it has a, a relic in there. So obviously I think I'll do these first and the fat ones. This is, let's see if it's on here and I don't like, is this 2010 and 11? Okay, this is 2011 and 2012 because just because you get, if you guys never know and you want to know when the cards were put on the shelf or printed, um, this was July 2012, so that's a very old one. Um, and these from 2014, 15. I'll do this one first. Uh, and this is NBA Hoops. Uh, retail, obviously, and Mario, Mario Chalmers, Doug Collins, Emeka Okafor, KD, so that's pretty awesome, franchise grades. I don't know what the value of, I guess maybe as he gets older and maybe closer to retirement, maybe the original team he started with, this might be worth something. Like if you get like a Sonics one, I think it's probably worth a lot of money. So I wonder about, since this is already like seven years old, I wonder if this stuff will have some value. And Kevin McHale for the Rockets. And a discount code. I wonder if that still works. I should try that one day. So anyways, I didn't expect much of that. Those are probably almost like a dollar pack. Um, so I'll do the 14, 15 hoops. And like I said, there's... Oh, just in case... I know I kind of skimmed over, but just in case somebody didn't see the original one, you get three fat packs, four factory sealed packs, an auto or relic, and a bonus item, all for $20. So uh, every time I go now to Walmart, I like grab... These. Everybody's been telling me they've been uh, grabbing these too. Uh, so Rudy Gay, Ben McLemore, and like I tell people, foil is cool. It's nice. It adds a lot of value to it, but it's so hard to read it. Um, oh, nice. So this is a really good ad. I'll probably put this up there. Uh, Joel Embiid, rookie, but uh, <laughs> um. He still needs to do a little bit better, and the team needs to do a little bit better. An insert of it's probably Kenneth Farid. Yep, Kenneth Farid for the Nuggets. That's the back of it, not short printed or anything. Steve Novak, Lewis Williams, 
Jason Smith, Jamal Crawford, Henry Sims, Spencer Hawes. I actually have an autograph of him. Um, I'll probably put the KD up here because it's an older card and uh, he's one of my favorite players. I know people don't like him because he went to the Sonics. I mean the uh, the Warriors, but I liked them way before then and even in college. I actually, I'm one of those people that maybe don't like that he went there, but I still I still like him. Uh, Tyreek Evans, Will Bynum, uh, Thanaeus, Antetokounmpo, and a Chris Bosh. I guess like a, a checkerboard parallel refractor Miles Pumley Tyler Hansborough Bellinelli Dwight Howard Blake Griffin and Jody Meeks you know it's funny I, and I think most people do that like we're so like used to trying to read the names, but then if you just look at the player, like if you, if I don't show you the the name, everybody should know that's Blake Griffin. But most of the time, I'm so worried about looking at the the name that I should probably just know that that's Blake Griffin, Dwight Howard, Bellinelli, Tyler Hansborough, Plumley. So it's funny how like the mind works, I guess, in a way. Oh, it's probably a decoy. Uh, Boris Diaw, Tyler Zeller. Wow, that's pretty interesting. Zach Levine, a rookie card. So th these these are having really nice rookie cards so far. Um, like he's the dunk champion, and here's a really nice insert. Boston Garden. Bill Russell. That's pretty sweet. I'm not going to put that there, but it is pretty nice. And a decoy. Al Jefferson. Doral Wright. Brandon Bass. Raymond Felton. And Steve Nash. So that is probably pretty much what I expected from the thinner retail packs. Hopefully these will be a little bit better. Uh, let me just go over them real quick. 16, 17, Donruss. I don't know why that's not focusing. I think because it's nighttime, it's a little bit darker. Um, 15, 16. And 16, 17, 16, 17. I'm just going to go in date order, I guess. So it's complete KD again. Nice. This is starting to be a mess. There's probably no reason for me to do that. Um, Lance Stevenson, Joaquim Noah, Al Farouk Aminu, Josh Smith, Al Horford, Chris Middleton, Meritich, Archie Goodwin. That sounds like such an old name. Mario Chalmers, sweet, pretty nice. Kobe Bryant, Tristan Thompson, Matt Bonner, Michael Carter Williams when he was on the Bucks, 15-16. I know he got drafted by the Sixers. I didn't realize he went to the Bucks that that uh, early into his career. Uh, Moskov, Brandon Knight. Tony Parker, Tony Allen, Terry Rozier, Deron Hilliard, Pierre Jackson. These are all rookies. Lance, Larry Nance Jr., Dante Cunningham, Steve Blake. That's an awesome picture. It just looks like that's an, like a painting, just the way like somebody sketched that. I know it's not, but it just looks like that one. Kabalko, I don't know who that is. Vince Carter, Hazanja, 
and a yellow. Oh, these are all like short print ones. Kevin Martin. I don't know what the rarity is on the yellow. I'm just going to assume that's probably better than the grays. Zach Levine. Aaron Baines. Pau Gasol. Aldemir. Rudy Gay. Oh, Tyus Jones. There was somebody that used to uh, be a, a subscriber that loved Tyus Jones because he, he played for Duke. Is that his rookie card? Yeah, it is his rookie card. So I'll put that one there for him. I forget what his name was. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's a really nice one to get. So that... No autographs, but two rookie cards. I mean, Tyus Jones I don't think is in the league anymore. And I'm sure I'm going to get bashed if I'm wrong um, I'm going to do, I like Donruss so I'm going to do Threads and I forgot too that Threads has um, those jersey cards in here so I'm hoping to get at least one of those which I don't think I did but it's fine I did so well on the first one that I would, I'm not going to complain uh, Malik Beasley Kawhi Leonard Malcolm Brogdon, I'll put that one there because it's a good rookie. Um, Patrick Beverly. Diallo. Oh, he won. Was that him that won the dunk contest? It was, wasn't it? I'm going to put that there because I think he won the dunk contest, unless I'm totally wrong. Uh, Damian Lillard. Mario Saric, that's a pretty good one too. Oh, I thought that was Derrick Rose. I was going to freak out. Uh, I'm like, that's pretty awesome for Derrick Rose. But Jimmy Butler is pretty good, too. So, I mean, this is getting a little bit better as far as cards and rookie cards. No autos or hits, but uh, it's still better. Uh, it's still pretty nice. Uh, have a check. Robert Covington. Justice Winslow. Chris Paul. Dennis Schroeder. Paul George, Tony Snell. So that one was pretty, pretty all right. And the last one with the last hope, maybe hopefully look for an autograph. Um, but like I said, the the one, the last one was obviously really, really nice. So it's it's kind of hard to duplicate that. DJ McConnell, TJ, Derek Rose, pretty sweet, Isaiah Thomas, Dirk, Stanley Johnson, Amir Caspi, I, I probably said that wrong, uh, Kevin Love, CJ Miles, Rodney Hood, Rondo, Dennis Schroeder. I get a lot of Dennis Schroeder stuff. I even have his rookie autograph. Uh, Jeff Teague. Alec Burks. Chris Middleton. Damian Lillard. Zach Levine. Dennis. Uh, Devin Booker. Kawhi. Trevor Ariza. Kyle Lowry. Brandon Ingram. I like I like him a lot. I don't, is he still on? I don't even know if he's still on the Lakers. Um, Trevor Ariza, not numbered, but it's a refractor. I thought these usually were numbered, but I don't see it, so I'm not gonna stress out. Um, this is pretty awesome. I wonder what the rarity are, is on these, because I've I've been obviously doing cards for a long time. I don't think I've ever gotten a Hall King at all. It's not numbered. Uh, these, if it was numbered, probably worth a lot. Because I don't think I've really seen any Hall Kings. Because I'm sure, obviously, there's not that many Hall of Fame players. Um, Henry Ellingson, rookie. Don Maker, rookie. Chris Dunn, rookie. Ron Baker, rookie. Isaiah Cousins, rookie. Marcus Page, rookie. 
Joel Balambi, a Balamboy, sorry. All right, so those were okay. Some decent rookies and some inserts. And this is pretty strange, but I don't think I can use this. Oh, okay, I thought it was, I really thought it was an iPhone. So this is the bonus um, that you're guaranteed. Last time I got a Carmelo little die cast Hummer, uh, which I didn't open. I don't know if I'll open this. Um, but it's a travel tag. I think maybe sometime in the future, if somebody's a Bulls fan, I would probably do it for a giveaway. Um, but it's pretty much a tag. Uh, you write your name and you put on your luggage. So when you go to the airport, you know which one's yours. Or if it gets lost, they can mail you your luggage, the uh, airline. Uh, first, I thought it was a wallet when I put, pulled it out. Then I thought it was in, like an iPhone case. But to find out it's a travel tag, that's kind of like, I don't think I'll be traveling anytime soon. And I don't think I'll put that on there. I am a huge Bulls fan. So I might just take it out the case or just keep it in the case and display it somewhere. Um, now, you do you are guaranteed an autograph or mem card and i think because the box is okay not that they know what's inside each pack the card is actually not bad the only thing is which most people complain about and i can understand especially for an autograph why they don't sleeve it up and i've seen somebody complain about it in the video too where it's like it's a penny sleeve i mean it doesn't cost a lot but i don't know it is what it is. Unless it's in there and I just missed it and it fell out the sleeve. So I shouldn't complain because I didn't double check it. But it's a really nice autograph. He's not that bad. Um, and it's a this whole box, it feels like a Bucks box for some reason. But it's a 2012-13 Contenders, Tobias Harris, who, if I'm not mistaken, thought he played for UNC. And that's the thing I don't like. See, I, I don't get this. Did he not have a rookie card? Was he not drafted? Because, wait. So he played on the 11, 12 bucks. But this is 12, 13, and it's a rookie. I'm, I'm dying to find out what college you went to. I'm almost going to bet that he played for UNC. Oh, no, okay. I'm such an idiot. Um, so I like that they do this. Okay, so he was drafted in the first round, and he played for Tennessee. And I'm hoping that's the college. I thought he played for UNC. But anyways, I'm just going to assume that means Tennessee Volunteers. Uh, first round. And I like that they put that on there. That's all I always say that I wish they kept doing. But like I said, these are the older cards. They're a lot thicker. Uh, and it's a rookie autograph. Um, I I thought he was a really good player. I think he might still be in the league. Um, but I'll have to do some research. So otherwise, I don't know why they wouldn't put that in the... A sleeve I would and it's a rookie autograph so that's pretty awesome I have to find out what team he's on if he's still there but that's kind of a see I, I don't want to say any more about this not being in the sleeve because I, I didn't double check anything yet but uh it's not a bad autograph it kind of makes up for the box um well I don't mean to keep rambling on because it's gonna end up being a 20 minute video this is cool because I'm a huge Bulls fan like I tell people if I ever decide to do any trades or work a trade out, it would be Bulls or Spurs or Nets or another player that I, I really, really like. Um, and it has to be like a good player from those teams. Um, so it kind of, the autograph makes up for it because, you know, it's a lot rarer to get an autograph. But these weren't that bad. Um, I mean, the, the cards were okay, but these were, were not that bad. A Shaq, Hall Kings, like, like I said, I've opened a lot. I don't think I've ever seen a Hall King. Uh, Trevor Reza, Jimmy Butler, 
Diallo. I think he won the dunk contest, and I'm going to sound silly if he didn't. Malcolm Brogdon. This is probably one of the most valuable cards in here. Um, but I obviously have to wait for him to keep doing what he's doing. Maybe win a championship, an MVP or something. Uh, keep in mind, he's only been in the league for about three years. Three or four years. Uh, Tyus Jones. Kevin Martin. This, these, all these are like all from the same box and they're all rookie Timberwolves. Timberwolves must have been really bad that they drafted really high. Oh, that's probably for the Kevin Love trade, wasn't it? What year was it? Was Kevin Love... That was probably the year they got a lot of draft picks or something, hopefully. Uh, I'm right. For Kevin Love. Um, for the, From the Cavs. This is a really nice one. Too bad it's not like a... Like, th this would have been nice if it was this. Parallel. That would have been awesome. KD. A Zach Levine rookie. So, uh, actually, let me count it just for the uh, thumbnail. So, that's one. One awesome rookie. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. So, about six. So that's not bad. I mean, there's a lot of cards to look through, but I think those were the best that I kind of noticed right away. Uh, and that's pretty much it. So anyways, I have one more of these left. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'll probably do the next one in a couple days. All right, I'll see you guys.